وکیلا لذیذ ٹکاؤ بازا اندر ارب کم دا سیم کوشچن از پٹ ٹو دی گاڈ فیئرنگ پیپل آلسو واٹ ہیز سینٹ یور لارڈ واٹ نیو ریولیشن ہیز کم ٹو محمد صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم واٹ از دی نیو بازا اندر ارب کم واٹ ہیز بین سینٹ ڈاؤن بائی یور لارڈ کالو خیرا دیر ریپلائی از کوڈ واٹ ایور اللہ سبحان و تعالیٰ ہیز سینٹ ڈاؤن آن محمد صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم اٹ از نائس اٹ از کوڈ کالو خیرا للذین احسنوا في هذه الدنيا حسنه پیپل ہو ٹیک ٹو گڈ ڈیڈز دے ہیو گڈنس ان دس ورلڈ آلسو देयर لائف اف دس ورلڈ آلسو بیکمز حسنہ بیکمز گڈ دے ار کنٹینٹڈ یو نو دے ہیو دی انر پیس ود ان देयर ہارٹس سو دے ہیو دی حسنہ ان دس ویری ورلڈ ولا دار الاخرت خیر ولا نعم دار المتقین and as for the abode of the hereafter that is much better much better in this world also hasana rabbana atina fid dunya hasana wa fil akhirati hasana but the hasana of akhirat is much greater and greater and greater wala ni'ma darul muttaqin and definitely that dwell that dwellings of the god fearing people will be very fine jannat wa adnin those will be the gardens of eternity perpetuity gardens which will remain forever yad khulunaha in which they will enter tajri min taat al anhar beneath them rivers will be flowing lahum fiha ma yashaun for them everything will be provided which they will ask everything whatever they demand whatever they ask for will be provided kazalika yazillahu al muttaqin and in this way allah will reward those who had regard for him in the life of this world allazina tatabaffahum al malaikatu tayyibin now the contrast the malaika will be taking out the lives and souls of the kuffar also but also the believers also have to die but what will happen when the angels take up, take out the souls of the of of muttaqin tayyibin that they are in a very good shape at that time yaqulun assalamun alaykum and the angels would say to them peace be on you udkhulul jannata bima kuntum ta'malun now go and enter the paradise for the deeds that you have done and whatever you have earned in the life hal yanzuruna illa an ta'tiyahum al malaikatu aw yaatiya amru rabbik Are they waiting for the time when the angels will come? The angels will come on the day of judgment. Not in this world now. And the angels will come when the resurrection is there. وَجَاءَ رَبُّكَ وَالْمَلَكُ صَفًّا صَفًّا At that time, Allah will descend down and Balaika, the angels will be in the form of multitudes, armies, صَفًّا صَفًّا but not today so are they waiting for that time to come they will believe only at that time hal yanzuruna illa an taatiyahu al malaika aw yaati amru rabbik or the final judgment from your lord comes then there will be no time for repenting or mending your ways kazalika fa'al allazina min qablihim this was the attitude that was adopted by those who were before them the people of nu and hu and sali and so on and so forth وَمَا ظَلَمَهُمُ اللَّهُ وَلَاكِنْ كَانُوا أَنفُسَهُمْ يَزْلِمُونَ And Allah didn't wrong, do anything wrong to them. Actually, they wronged themselves. Whatever they got were their own deeds, their own earnings. فَأَسَابَهُمْ سَيِّعَاتُ مَا عَمِلُوا وَحَاقَ بِهِمْ مَا كَانُوا بِهِ يَسْتَحْزِئُونَ So then, all the bad deeds that they had earned, the punishment, that came over them afflicted and they were encompassed by their deeds and they were encompassed by the same things about which they had been mocking oh 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 ganna okay there will be fire oh what type of a fire it will be they used to laugh at the at the messenger of allah at the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam but now they will be encompassed and surrounded by those very things 
about which they had been laughing and mocking. وقال الذين أشركوا لا شاء الله ما أبدنا من دونه من شيء نحن ولا أباؤنا and these people who associate other deities with Allah subhanahu wa taala they say had Allah willed we would not have worshipped neither we nor our elders forefathers would have worshipped anyone except Allah he is he has all the authority he could stop our forefathers he could stop us if he didn't stop our forefathers he didn't stop us it means there is an implied permission of allah subhanahu wa taala that we can associate others with him wa qala alladhina ashraku law sha allah ma abadna min dunihi min shay nahnu wala abauna wala haramna min dunihi min shay and in the same way we would not have declared anything as forbidden without the permission of allah kazalika fa'al alladhina min qablihi in this way exactly this was the saying of those people who were before them so to say history is repeating itself the same thing was said by the nations to which the former messengers of allah were sent fa hal ala rasul ala rusul ila al balagh al mubin so there's no duty no responsibility over of the messenger of allah except to convey the message clearly that's all one whether somebody accepts it or not well he will have to reply on the day of judgment the responsibility of the messenger is to convey the message of allah wa laqad ba'asna fi kulli ummatin rasulan and we sent and raised in every community every ummah a rasul a messenger there has been no nation of the world to which some messenger was not sent wa laqad ba'asna fi kulli ummatin rasulan an i'budu allah wa ittabi at-tahut what was said to them by all the messengers you should obey worship allah and avoid whosoever defies allah or is declared partner with him taghut what is taghut taga something who defies defiant so whosoever is challenging the authority of allah whether he is a human being or it's a constitution of a country we don't know who is allah we are sovereign ourselves it is taghut the biggest taghut of today is the non islamic state why they say we are sovereigns we can make any laws it's a revolt rebellion against allah subhanahu wa taala he is the sovereign al malik al quddus as salam al mumin al muhammin al aziz al jabbar al mutakabbir so if you don't accept him as such you are in revolt against in rebellion against him so you have to avoid this taghut you have to deny this taghut fa minhum man hada allah so some are from them whom allah subhanahu wa taala has guided to the right path wa minhum man haqqat alayhi dalala and there are others upon whom the error has justly established they have become you know rightful you know they they have all the right for all the punishment and chastisement of allah to come to them فَسِيرُ فِي الْأَرْضِ فَانْظُرُوا كَيْفَ كَانَ عَاقِبَةُ الْمُكَذِّبِينَ So travel in the land and see what has been the the result, what has been what was the end of those beliers, what happened to Qamenu, what happened to the people of Hud, what happened to the people of Saleh, عليه الصلاة والسلام. So you can travel in the land and you can find.